access to timely and actionable food security data can be difficult, but not with the Application Programming Interface, or API, launched by the Integrated Food Security Phase Classification, IPC. Part of our Data Access Initiative, the IPC, API, allows applications and websites to receive food security data securely and in real time. It adds to a suite of data exchange tools that aim to make IPC information open and more accessible. Partners can now access data from food security analysis dating back to 2017. Various formats are available, including detailed population estimates, as well as maps in GeoJSON and in vector tiles. These map tiles convey a variety of geographical information, including urban settlements as well as areas receiving humanitarian food assistance and much more. How the API works The IPC API acts as an intermediary between an application and a web server. It processes data transfer between systems, and if you want to access the IPC API, here's how it works. First, a partner initiates a request to the IPC via our simple online form. After validating the request internally, the IPC will share the API key with the requester in order to call the external web server. The server will then send a response to the API with the requested information, and then the API transfers the data to the application making the request. What you get. Developers will receive technical documentation, source codes, and standard operating procedures to test and install the API. After successful activation, partners and decision makers will have real-time access to acute food insecurity data from IPC analysis to support response decisions in more than 30 different countries facing food crisis. If you have any questions about how to use and access the API, please do not hesitate to email us at ipc-techsupport at fao.org.